we're gonna spend an afternoon to go do something I've never done before and even have done before too it's a uh, perch fishing down on the beach so I've been told that there are red tail surf perch down here I've never caught one before so we're gonna go give it a go the wind is coming from northwest where we found this little bay that's kind of uh, sheltered so should be okay I've done some surf fishing in Australia before so I have some kind of idea of how to do but uh, this is a brand new experience and I'm really looking forward to it. Hope we can get a new species off the list. Yeah, or like catch something that we wouldn't even expect to catch. Yeah. That's always better is when yeah. you, you hook something, you don't know what it is, and you bring in it's something that we couldn't even think of before. Yeah. And like that's the thing with soul water fishing, right? Those. You never know what you're gonna get. It could be a mermaid. Perch. Mermaid, okay. <laughs> you do that, you catch a mermaid. Flounder. How about <laughs> a Pacific lump sucker? They're tiny though. A northern clingfish. They also don't get big. I love the smell of the ocean, especially like wood. It's supposed to be rainy today and it's gorgeous. Like I put on too many layers. I'm like, it's gonna be windy, it's gonna be rainy, and I'm like, I'm hot. Yeah, that looks like a sandwich. <laughs> Looks tasty. I'm gonna walk Linda out and see the, see what it cast. You're gonna have to watch where the rocks are first, so you don't ca so you don't cast into them, yeah, right? Yeah. So, so just watch a little right bit. One right in front of us. Yeah, there's one right in front of us. Whoa! Whoa! Oh yeah, you. there's there's <laughs> holes right behind <laughs> the rocks. And that's probably where the fish are. That's actually, what yeah. I was thinking. Yeah. Because when I was walking around, I'm like, behind every big rock this is a... pretty good right here. But if they see something, right, they'll come out. Yeah, yeah. Just watch a few more waves and see. This is so intense. I know. <laughs> Water's always moving. So there's one there. Yeah. I think that's... There's one right, right, right in front of us. Yeah. One right there. Oh. Okay, here we go. There's one right there. Whoa, that's a big wave coming. That's it, big. I think you're fine if it just casts over. Is it, I don't know, is it too shallow? I don't know. Yeah. I just aim that way. Oh. Okay, let us settle. The bottom. It slowly comes in. Yeah, it slowly so. comes in for sure. Yeah, and that that the waves give the bait action too, right? So. That's good. Yeah, there you go. Okay, I'm gonna leave Linda B and rig up my rod. This is tough. We've got big waves happening. I don't know what it cost. Oh, 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 wait, wait, wait. But Linda, Linda got one. She got, she got a slip perch. She was so skeptical. Yeah, she caught one right now. <laughs> yeah. Is that not? Is it? Is it one or is it? What, huh? Is it the red tail? Or there I don't you know go. What they look like. No, that's a that's a power perch. Yeah, that's, that's what the, I was thinking. That's, hey, that's the red a... tail. And you were skeptical. <laughs> look at it. Yeah. So red red tail perch. I'm assuming have the red tails. But I thought. Yeah. No. This is yeah, a no, power perch. Yeah. No. It's power from. Yeah. Because I can see from below they have that. So I turned around. And I thought you got kelp on your line. Then no, it it went, I knew I had to because it went ding, 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 and I was like, what the heck? Nice. Look at it. I love catching perch. It's so pretty. They are pretty. Yeah. Well, we gotta like, go way out. Be free. Don't ask me where it went. <laughs> Good oh. job, five minutes in and 
That was, okay, that was... That was fun, see? No, no, yeah. Oh, I should stop being so pessimistic. Yeah, she was so... She was so skeptical. I was she, like, I want to go catch Greenling on the rock. Yeah. Like, I don't want to sit here. She kept this. talking about going over there because she wants to catch a Greenling. But I'm like, no, we got to stay here. We're going to catch some perch. Round two. I'm going to go set up again. Let's see if she gets another one. <laughs> that was pretty exciting. So these perch, there's, there's a few different species of perch in BC. The most common ones are um, pile perch, the striped perch, the shiner perch. Those three species you'll find around, if you go down to any of the seaside uh, piers and dock, uh, you'll, you'll find them. Um, whereas red-tailed surf perch tend to hang out in this kind of habitat, in um, like on the surf, that's why it's called a surf perch. It weighs a little too big over that way. It gets better this side. This one, bite. Huh? Are you yeah, yeah. I missed two already. Definitely bites, and that wasn't a wave. Oh, bite, bite, bite. Oh, bite. Those bites. Yeah, those tap, tap, tap. Yeah. You gotta like. Oh, I got your line. What the? Was that you, Lin? One more. There you go. What? Look, Linda got another one. What the heck, man? Why can't I catch one? That's another power perch, eh? Linda too. Rod zero as usual. She couldn't even feel the bite, so maybe she's she's getting bites, but she's not hooking them. Just letting them swallow it. But um, maybe I'm setting the hook too fast. Who knows? Fish on, fish on, fish on, fish on. That's a nice one. That's a nice one. That's a nice one. Yes. Oh, fights well, eh? Coming right in. Oh, hit it right away. That fish. Yes. What do I have? I got a red tail surf perch. Yes, I got a red tail surf perch. Look at it. I'm going to keep this one here. That's my very first one. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. And that was a good spot. That was a good spot. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Look at that. We're keeping this for dinner. All right, first red tail surf perch ever. Look at it. Good sized fish. Look at the colors. Like, look at the reds on the tail and the bands on the body. Pretty looking fish. <laughs> so happy with this first one ever. Yeah, you know what? I, I had so many bites, probably half a dozen times chances, but didn't hook them. This, this one actually just grabbed it right away as soon as I cast it out and hit it really hard and it fought pretty hard too. So yeah, let's get some more. Yeah, this is the spot. Oh! That was a bite. 
Do you have a bike? Right as it went down, they're getting it when it's sinking. Yeah, really big taps. So I had, an, I had a bite right when I first cast it, then I had one on for a bit, and as I was reeling, it went off. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, go on. Go on. Another one. Nice! This, yeah, another one. This is a smaller one though. Yeah, but still. This one and the other one. I think I might, if I can get a hook off, I'll, I'll let it go. Oh, uh, is it? No, it's definitely smaller. Yeah. Yeah. Just by a little bit though. Yeah. It's easy hooks, so. Yeah. Woo! Get pounded by the waves. <laughs> yeah, little guy. We'll let this one go. Go. <laughs> Don't go a little bit too much. It's quite snaggy over there. Oh, dude, wind it in. Stop. Like, I literally was slowly winding it. Yeah. They don't like it stagnant. No, no, they don't want it sitting, right? Yeah. Like the moving. Good job. Hey, that's a nice one. Yeah. Whoa, fat. Yeah, that's a nice one. Yeah. Fish and chips. Yeah. Oh, never mind. Oh, it's okay, we'll get more. That wrapped up our beach fishing session here in Tofino. We've been here for three hours and while we've been here, the tide has been coming in, uh, which made the fishing more challenging because the waves got bigger and uh, we find ourselves couldn't really anchor the, our setup properly. So couldn't really uh, king on the fish. But still, we got quite a few bites. Uh, in total, we uh, landed six fish. I decided to keep two red tail surf perch and Lena kept one little power perch because uh, it swallowed the hook. It was more ethical to just take it home and enjoy it. We, I, I'm sure we're going to enjoy those uh, fish very much once we get home. Thanks for watching everyone. If you have any other questions regarding fishing on the west coast of Vancouver Island, make sure you leave a comment on the bottom. I'm always happy to answer your question. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe to the channel. I really appreciate it. And until next time, good luck fishing. <laughs>